Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, it's Reggie, and today I'm going to be playing Cat's Tower. It may be about cats, but things are a little bit different here. Here is your full disclosure message that I have been paid to play this game. Very kind of Rhino Games LLC to pay me for doing so. In return for their payment, I guess what they're really hoping for is that you have a look at their game, play it, and carry on playing it if you enjoy it. If you want, of course. So I'm going to get it, first of all, and see what it's like. Well, apparently, actually, this is Cat's Tower 2, so very exciting indeed. Ah, right, well, that's immediately difficult. It's up the other way. This will be interesting to record. I mean, if you build your game vertically, you build your game vertically, don't you? Um... <laughs> Welcome. Welcome to my Let's Play, everybody. We're starting off with some very sad music indeed, but in a kind of meaningful and thoughtful way. It's actually making me feel a little bit calm, a little bit emotional, because I, I suspect there's going to be a cat inside this box. And of course, that's quite sad. But hopefully I can rescue it, I guess, is the idea. Oh, oh, poor cat. Dangerous, but I'll do it. To anything to save this cat. Is it safe now? It's safe. <laughs> Oh, translate, I see, very nice. I mean, I've only saved you. I don't have to be your owner if you don't want. Oh, crikey, I've got another cat. Boy. Oh, honestly, this, this, wherever we are, this place, not good towards its cats, really, is it? Well, I want to give him a bit of personal space. Come on now. Okay. Right, okay. I, I, I just... I was willing to give the cats a room each. I mean, they didn't have a chance to meet or anything. Okay. I love that loading screen. I would love for more time to be spent on that loading screen. Right. Tap to drop. New cat. Right. Okay. Oh, I see. So we're sort of clicking away a bit arbitrarily. So we've got cats... It's a little, little bit sad that we've immediately lost the kind of sombre element. I know a game about cats isn't supposed to really be a sad occurrence, but I'm sorry, but I just, what I really want here is some thoughtfulness. Rescue the cats. Like a hot, proper whole kind of pre credit sequence. We're just like into a completely different gameplay mechanic now. What have we got with these two? Oh, cat. Stiff fur, but a kind heart. That's nice. Kind of Battle Cat style informational boxes. I mean, that's not an assertion as to which came first, I'm sure. Information boxes have been around a while. Get another of those. Two of those. And that makes a snowshoe. I, I call it like Smug Cat by the look of it, but yeah. I like the flowiness of the animations. Again, a bit different to what I'm used to. You and you then. You and you. Oh, that's nice. I like the level up sound because usually you'd have a da 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 or something like that. But it was just like a sort of a, a very polite round of applause. Hey, very good, very good. <laughs> so I'm tapping on these boxes at the same time. I see. Gosh, this is like classic memories of 2048, which I was not good at. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, Persian cat. I'm almost kind of choosing to ignore that message because that doesn't strike me as something that could possibly be true unless they've got a, a, a really miserably unengaged player base. It's kind of clickbaity and I don't like that. I do like this cat though. I definitely like this cat. Nice cat. What? What's that? You who? New, <laughs> New house. Who this? Lovely smiley cat. It's nice. Oh! The loading screen, oh but a brief glimpse. It's so cool in here. There's kitties in this room. Alright, I thought you were complaining about the heat, which is quite accurate to my places where I live, it tends to get a bit cold. I just don't like it hot. And it's expensive, isn't it, hot? Precious kitten. Place. Oh, Mood indicator. Alright. Let's decorate the room and I'll be happy. God dear, no, I wasn't rescuing you very long ago and now you're being really demanding. Right, okay. Yeah. Oh, and you want me to buy a mouse for you? The mouse has arrived, and you're very happy with it. And you've got a big old mouse, or a small cat. Excellent, you're happy. 
And we've hit level 3. Round of applause. Got some premium currency as well. Oh, look! We got huge numbers of coins. It's Battle Cats Rangers style. I love it. <laughs> oh, well, we got all the cats. I see. This is going to be like one of those mad restaurant games now. Right, I can't cater to your needs. What about you? Abyssian cat. Or is the carpet unhappy? Okay. <laughs> I can't work it out. Am I allowed to find out what you want? I can't can't give you what you want, alright? What? You want me to buy that? Who for? Alright, a cat that I can't tap on or something? Unless I'm missing something. I mean, when am I not? Oh, that's, that's had a kind of trickle-down effect on the other cats. That's a very optimistic view of how emotions work. Okay, someone else is happy. I must be happy myself as well now. So you want wool. I said tap on the wool. Too expensive. Get cheaper tastes. Honestly, the value brands are almost as good, if not better. What you want is still too expensive. And you're alright, so that's good. Alright. Well, I'll see you later then.